Hi, this is Andrew from Email Marketing NYC, and today I'll show you uh, the listing. It's very important for Klaviyo or any other email marketing services, but I'll show you how to do it in Klaviyo. What's a proper way to do it? First, we'll need to create suppression list uh, subscribers to suppress, and uh, pe different people use different uh, criteria. But for example, for this brand, I created. Uh, people who did not open any emails in 100 days, people who did not click 100 days, by the way, why I did open and click, because um, sometimes uh, Klaviyo miss tracking opens, but they track clicks. Also, who place zero orders, who receive at least 10 emails, and who, who is not on suppressed list, and also uh, we have re-engagement campaign, and um, I'm saying somebody who received uh, re-engagement the last email in re-engagement flow so basically this is so we currently we have i'm cleaning once a month and i already did like a few days ago so right now we have 48 members so what we need to do now we click uh, export segment to csv file and then we will import so list export okay this is good and now what we need to do we go to profiles uh, suppress profiles and now we click upload file and we are looking for that file so this is so I did on the fifth so this is online click OK upload suppress oh okay so this is a problem what we need to do now we need to to delete uh, all columns except the email column. So we have email. Okay, so now we do upload, we choose, we choose the correct file, this file, upload. So it will increase our suppression list uh, subscribers. By the way, it's, uh, all people who are on suppression list they are not counts towards your active subscribers. It means you do not pay for any suppressed list. Uh, I mean, anybody who are on suppressed list. So this is how you uh, clean your list. By the way, like if you have a lot of um, people who do not open your emails, like it, it, it will affect your deliverability. And it, I mean, <laughs> if people don't receive emails from you, they don't buy from you or they don't hear your message. So I highly, highly recommend. I know it's sometimes it's, it's good to have a big list and you don't want to delete emails. You don't want to delete emails from your list, but listen, if people don't buy from, if they do not open your emails, it's useless to have them in your list. So I highly recommend to do this at least once a month. Uh, if you're too busy, do it like at least once a quarter but you have to do it to clean up your list if you have any additional questions please let me know in comments below thank you